Here we go. Three, two, one, begin. Commit die. That's the kill. All right. Cyberian is off in a hurry. Afterburners and everything. I just love how FLC looks with these particles. Yeah, they're so pretty. Tasteful use of the emitters can result in extremely good results. Looks to me like Cybrian definitely has a plan. They're not losing time. Yes. Cybran certainly uh, were quick off the mark there. Yeah, I think they've uh, had the same opening strategy every single match that they've been in a tournament. Well, if it works. Yeah, nothing yeah. wrong with it. That still counts as a plan. Darth spinning off into the distance. A little engine pod off of one of the ships. Early exchange of fire here from either team. Arch firing his arrows into the block plate. Classic. Gonna see another bout of trench warfare. Yeah, the last 60s missiles just went right into the plate as well. Some seem to be sliding through. Dwarven up front acting as point defense for his entire fleet. Cybern is a higher seed, but both of these teams are, generally speaking, fantastic tactically. Absolutely. Yeah, the name Filthy Casuals is a bit of a misnomer. <laughs> yeah, if they're casuals, I'm respectable. <laughs> I don't know, they, they're kind of casual with the, the arrow placement into the blocker plate, but no, it seems those actually managed to get around. I think there's nothing casual about them. <laughs> These guys, uh, they knocked my team out of the first grand tournament. I didn't think they were casual back then either. <laughs> well, there's definitely nothing casual about that Graveling. No. Darth received the ire of some of those missiles. He's hiding behind the lower station shield. Completely yeah. unshielded that grid. Yeah. Shoot it, Darth. That's interesting tactic. I don't know what he's doing there. <laughs> Drawing fire. Both teams waiting. Baited breath for the zone to activate, I believe. Either of them have actually entered the zone. 50 well, seconds. These little chunks of, these little chunks of debris are, uh, you know, uh, ramming vessels. Just uh, hiding down here, waiting for an opportunity. I mean, if he just leaves those parked behind those shields, drawing missiles away, that's... Right. See you around, even. There's some value in that. Yeah. Yeah, worst case scenario is you lose a tiny amount of BP to soak some damage. Mm -hmm. But mostly that station shield is going to eat it all. Yeah. yeah. You need Everyone sustained fire. Kind of taking a few uh, long range missiles there. Zone's about to go live. 
dwarven making a move. That's it, unoccupied. It sounds active. Grim's out. Where are they going? Towards Big Rig. He's fully shunted forward. He's going to tank a lot of that. Dimitri's into the zone. Cybern have occupied five seconds, six seconds, and counting. And it's all still very tactical play there by both teams. Want to make sure, let the teams know what the cap is at every 30 seconds or so. Dwarven's moving in to contest. 60 taking some Grimfire here. It actually did land. Somebody hit somebody. Strongly agree. It seems Cybern has gotten the message. They're pushing forward. Here we go. So we're FLC. Huh. Alright, it's heating up. Gordon Cleric is the target of the wolf pack, and he is taking a lot of fire. Shields are holding up pretty well. Looks like Zero's digging into Dwarven now. Coming around behind. Yep. Zero staying on him while his team uh, engages uh, Arch in 3D. Abel and Dwarven keeping their fire on Zero. Yeah, I think they're trying to make Zero regret going in. Zero's shields are holding on pretty well, but he is uh, getting some distance. Dimitri's shields are down. Narrowly avoiding taking a full volley of arrows. Very narrowly. Dwarven is really starting to feel some pain now. Dimitri starting to move. Arch and 3D picking a new target because his x can't keep up with the, the fast movers. Heavy pounding on Dwarven now. Not sure if he's going to be able to make it. Not at this rate. He's almost down to half health. And that's an early red out from Dwarven. Yep. Turn up trying to save him, but didn't quite make it in time. Able and Arch and 3D taking this opportunity to focus on Big Rig, who was holding the zone uh, for his teammates. Looks like the wolf pack Big is Rig's reconvening. Doing okay. Yep, the wolf pack is already coming back for Cable. Whoa, big damage on Arch. Arch and 3D. Punishing fire from Big Rig. Yeah. So Arch. That's the next three gone. Soaking up the damage nicely, though. Oh! Whoa. Oh Terrible. no! Oh no! Look oh, at all oh, the no. sex threes oh, just flying no. off. Incredible. One, two, three, four, 
Five, six. Five, six. Did yeah. he? Oh. It was the whole moment. side of his battery. Oh, no. I didn't expect that. Zero's doing it again. No. <laughs> Hydrogen tanks exploding everywhere. There goes Zero all the way through. That is brutal. Yeah, that is, that is Arch pretty much defanged. Completely yeah, defanged. Evil. Absolutely evil. Did the merge it blocks turn off? Oh. 15 weapons, but I don't know what I mean, happening. merge blocks are gone. I think it's all point defense now. He's got some Artemis or something buried in him. But... That's going to be crushing for their chances. The ship. Oh, still responding. I don't, I don't suppose that there was batteries attached to those X3s. There was. I think they're gone, though. Yeah. Uh, oh, I mean, okay. Arch isn't completely useless. He still has his arrows. Yeah, he's got some arrow launchers. And he's got some Ares. Yeah, I noticed when all those X3s flew off, they were taken by the garbage collector, which means they had no power on them. Uh, yeah. Well, I uh, imagine the shock of the impact from Zero may have destroyed the batteries. At least a few of them. Oh, man. It's just getting brutalized by Big Rig. Oh yeah, that repeating fire. The Greek shield's gonna be going down here in a bit, but the wolf pack is over on the other side of the map. Cable's getting focused. And he gets sawn in half. No thirds. Ooh. Oh no, that's him. That's him. <laughs> He's Ooh. gone red. I thought he down to three oh. active ships now and Cybram with a very significant battle point lead. Yeah, this is looking pretty convincing. Well, Big Rig just took some nukes to the rear. As is tradition. Okay. He's not giving up on Arkin 3D. He'll not till her name goes red. That's right. So who do they have left? Dwarven's red. Turnip is... Oh, well, he's still flying. How much of him is still going? One weapon. Oh, Darth comes in with a ram on Big Rig. <laughs> Did not seem to do much. Nope. Nope. She's a little bit light for that, but he's trying. He's trying. He's, he's really trying. trying. <laughs> oh, Big Rig has noticed the annoyance. Get out of there, Darth. Run. <laughs> I don't think oh, he God. can. He's out of thrust. <laughs> Your life ends five <laughs> seconds from now. Uh. No, bro. That, that's it. There he goes. Watch it. <laughs> yep, the fly has been defeated. Now, now Arkin. Oh, bonk. Also, not effective. Big Rig seems like he's ram resistant. Well, he think... still has shields. Yeah, yeah, that's a function of having shields and being really, really heavy. I mean, that uh, Big Rig is. You know, living up to his name, he is, he is one chunk of heavy armor. You know? He is a large lad. Oh, time to return the favor. Yep, yeah, there you go. Counter ramp. Very effective. Crunching <laughs> through the remainder of the ship. He's got some friends helping now. Got some fairly chunky separations happening. I can't believe this guy is still alive. Not gonna be much longer now. Under 5,000 battle points in FLC versus 29,000. Yeah. 18%. It was calling you GG already. <laughs> Where, where's Turnip? Uh, Turnip's over here trying to play with Dimitri. Dimitri uh, just hanging out. He's got like two thrusters. Wow. No weapons. The back of Dimitri is completely open. Oh, here comes Turnip. Smack. <laughs> and Arch has gone red. Turnip's the last man standing on FLC. He's got no weapons, though. And about to have no yeah. thrust. Nope. Yeah. Yep. Well, uh, I think we can all use our galaxy brains and figure out how this match is going to go. Nope, don't need to. He's gone uh, red. Yep, it's gone. <laughs> That's and a total red out victory. Is. Combat very, victory very, confirmed. Very solid victory. Uh, Ooh. Oh, Nice job, Cybram. Incredible work, especially that ram on. 
<laughs> yeah, with all the I wish I. Oh no. I wish I had been recording. Hard. I saw everything. The, yeah. Each X three separating perfectly. I had it on stream. But let, 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 let's be honest here. When it when it comes to FLC, I think it's fair to say that you can take their lives, but you can never take their grievance. <laughs> yeah, they went on. They went on style. Yeah. Yep. The, the moral victory of this match is FLCM declaring that right now.